this is uh, the classic WPO pickup truck and I just wanted to show you guys underneath here uh, this one I have put in a bigger motor that's the 370 motor uh, we've got this heat sink on it as well uh, the heat sinks probably unnecessary but I put it in there anyway um, it almost gets in the way of the drive shaft but not quite so haven't really had a problem with it so far I guess you could sand it down a little bit if you wanted to um, putting it in you have to um, cut the pickup bed where the battery goes because uh, the battery won't fit in there um, and the uh, motor is a bit higher so to make a bit of space you have to cut that bed when you're putting it in also at the front here kind of where the serving servo is uh, you have to cut a lot of plastic away because the motor is quite large um, and it fits in there yeah I think this is like a 370 um, with the metal gearbox the metal gearbox is very nice because it gives it a lot more power and a lot more torque and um, you know the gears don't uh, was it bind or splinter so much so yeah pretty happy with it um, it's got um, metal uh, gears in the front and back metal axles and metal drive shafts I'll just show you how it runs um, this has got the original battery in the back at the moment and it's just basically an RTR that's had this change to it I've still got some more work to be done on it um, but it gives it a lot more climbing ability. It's quite slow though, uh, sometimes frustratingly so, um, because it's just a single gear. It's a single slow gear, but um, certainly an improvement and certainly something fun. So yeah, as you can see, this truck's had a lot of uh, a lot, lot of uh, mud and it's been through the wars a little bit. It's a bit trash, but that's kind of what these little trucks are for, right? Having fun with. So anyway, that's what it is.